Hello children. How are you all? Hope you're all fine and safe. I'm Mrs. Rani, 3rd standard science teacher. Kindly follow all safety measures children. Wash your hands frequently. Eat healthy food. Avoid going out unnecessarily and spend good time with your parents. Okay? And please don't waste time in watching TV and playing video games. Concentrate and don't skip the video. Are you ready to start today's session children? Okay, good. Lesson number three, force. Lesson, last class we started, isn't it? Okay, we studied in the force lesson about simple movements, actions, motion and force. What is force children? Force is a push or a pull on an object, isn't it? So you are clear about this, right? In today's session, we are going to learn about effect of forces. Effect of forces, it can change the direction, it can change the speed, it can stop a moving object, it can change the shape. So, we are going to learn one by one in detail in today's video. Force changes direction. Okay, first we are going to learn this only. See the picture children, a person hitting a ball, isn't it? A Cricket, football, whatever the game, when you're playing, the ball is coming very fast near to you. Okay, it's coming in the direct, di this direction, isn't it? But when you're hitting the ball with the bat, it's going in the opposite direction. You're changing the ball's direction by giving a force in the bat. Understand? See the picture, first picture, playing tennis. This is also a very good example for force changes direction, isn't it? Okay, next we are going to learn about force changes motion. See, a boy is riding a cycle in the second picture, isn't it? When the boy uh, giving a force that is pushing the pedal, the cycle starts moving, isn't it? When he is pushing, that is when he is applying force, putting the force very high, speed will be more, isn't it? So that is called as a force can change the speed. So when you are applying a force, when you are putting the force, when you are pedaling very fast, the speed will be more. But when you are applying the brake or you are stop pedaling, the cycle will stop. Stop. So the cycle will stop when he stops pedaling, isn't it? So this is the example for force can change the speed. Okay, children, are you understood? Okay, now next we are going to see. Next we are going to learn about force can stop a moving object. An object stops moving when we apply a force in an opposite direction. That is, when you are playing a football, have you seen a goalkeeper will be standing in the opposite side? They will do a catch, isn't it? They will start uh, when you are throwing the ball, uh, they will jump and they will be catching the ball, isn't it? They are putting their force to stop that ball, isn't it? Same way in the vehicles, uh, even in this picture you can see uh, some of the vehicles are there. What we'll be using for stop the vehicles? We'll be using brake, isn't it? So that is a force. We are applying a force to stop, in a, stop a moving object. Moving object. So, force can stop a moving object. Okay, children. Next, we are going to learn force can change the shape. The last effect of force we are going to learn about force can change the shape. See the picture. The effect of force, the clay pottery. Have you seen the clay pottery, children? Or uh, we play the uh, molding the clays, isn't it? We will be making lot of shapes, isn't it? And uh, next example in this picture, you are seeing a lemon. The, when you are making a lemon juice, you are squeezing the lemon, isn't it? The lemon will be like a ball, like a shape, isn't it? But when you are pushing and you are squeezing it, it's changing its shape, isn't it children? So force can change the shape. Okay, now we came to the end of today's session, children. Today, we learned about the effect of forces. Okay, force can change the direction, force can change the speed, force can stop a moving object, force can change the shape. Okay, and force can change the motion also. Okay, uh, understand clearly, children. 
please don't skip the video watch completely children so that you won't have any doubt in the topics okay children do the assignment neatly in the uh, note and write it clearly learn nicely for the weekly test thanks for watching children bye see you in the next video